When Larry Edgeworth said he had your back, you knew you were covered. It wasn't just knowing that he'd deliver on the sound. It was that in any situation, he was on guard to make sure you were okay, mentally, physically. He was a protector. He was a bear of a man and a teddy bear at the same time. Larry complained if you snapped his picture, hardly cracking a smile, but that was a front. His real smile was infectious, and his voice echoed across the newsroom. You always knew when Larry was in the house with a hello and a hug. He'd ask about your family and proudly share tales of his own sons, Alex, Miles, and his wife, Crystal. For today, Larry lugged his gear across the planet and up the highest peaks, recording the sounds of war natural disasters, presidential campaigns, Olympic games. Larry, Larry, teacher Larry. <laughs> connecting with those he met along the way. So after 25 years at NBC, a moment of silence, clear audio for the man who would appreciate it most. That was wow. a beautiful Larry. tribute, Savannah. Wow. Yeah. Well, he was a very, very loved person at NBC, and everybody has a story about Larry. Um, and he was just so loved. He, we were on the campaign together back in 2008, and we traveled for two solid months together. Every morning, every night, we were all together. And he was unfailingly kind and professional and loving, and he just had this way of feeling like, like he had your back, yeah. like you were safe in his hands in every way. And I just, um, my heart goes out to his family and to all our colleagues. We really, really loved Larry and he loved us. And I think that's why, why it feels, why it hurts. It's why it's so hard. I was thinking about seeing him in the hallways around here and how he always made, like it was never about Larry. Like whenever anyone else was around, it was always about them. And I remember thinking like, wow, what a guy in a world where people are constantly talking about how they're doing and how they're feeling. He's always asking how everyone was doing and feeling. And he did. He made you feel safe. And Savannah, those words were beautiful, beautiful. You know, I just, I, a, a, a colleague, somebody um, who doesn't work at NBC sent me a note and said, I was so sorry to hear about Larry. Mm -hmm. And I said, Yes, it's sad. He was so, he's so beloved. And she wrote me back. Then he made a difference in this world. Mm. And he did. 